What are you gonna wear Friday to the Halloween party? Probably the same thing I wore last year. Girl, no. What? It's a good costume. Yeah, but you've already been Dr. Phil five years in a row. It's my staple. Jess, we're sophomores now. We need to wear something spicy. Hey, Dr. Phil is spicy. I cannot believe you just said that. I don't really have the money to buy a new costume this year. Why don't you ask your parents for some money? Hey, Mom. Yes? Can I borrow 20 bucks? Maria and I are gonna go to the mall tonight. Not this week, sweetie. I'm sorry. It's okay. Don't worry about it. But here, I saw this flyer about someone needing a babysitter. Why don't you call them and see if you can do that for some extra cash? I'll look into it. Thanks. Hello? Hey, my name's Jessica, and I'm calling about your babysitting ad. Great. Would you be able to start tonight? Yeah, I could start tonight. Meet us at 6. Wait, how much does it pay? The pay starts at 100 an hour. It pays what? Thank you for coming over on such short notice. No problem. Are you going to be able to spend the night too? Oh, um, I'd have to check with my mom. Great, go ahead and do that. Here are the guidelines for babysitting. We'll see you tomorrow morning. Wait, you're leaving already? Did you have any questions? No, but I haven't even checked with my mom yet. Our numbers are on the sheet. Give us a call if you can't stay. Tiffany should sleep the entire time we're gone. No need to check on her for she might wake up. Be aware of words Tiffany doesn't like. Hello, no, Teletubbies, and babysitter. Have fun and thank you. They didn't leave a phone number. Mom, the parents asked me if I could spend the night with the kid. Yeah, that's fine, sweetie. Are you sure you don't want me to come back home? No, usually overnight gigs pay a lot of money. Yeah, well... Mom? I can't go to the mall tonight. What? Why? I'm babysitting. Babysitting for who? Some family my mom found an ad for. Hopefully the kid's cool. But it's sus over here, Maria. The parents didn't even leave a phone number. We're back. How'd it go? Fine. I don't think she woke up. Happy to hear that. Here's your payment. Thanks. But you guys should really leave a phone number next time. We told you. Our phone number was on the paper. See? That wasn't there, I swear. Are you able to do the same time tomorrow? Same price? Yeah, that works. I'll be here. Thanks again, we'll see you tomorrow. Bye, have fun. Who are you? Tiffany. Your name's Tiffany? No. So you lied? Because I hate liars. No, I'm Jessica and you're Tiffany. No shit, Sherlock. Language. What are you doing in our house? I'm your, be aware of words Tiffany doesn't like, babysitter. Watcher. Watcher? What do you think I am, a pet? No, no, no. Good. Then I won't have to kill you. Good. Yet. Go ahead, eat whatever you want. Where is the paper? Here it is. No phone number. They said there was a phone number. You're not gonna find it. Find what? Their phone number. They never leave it for the watchers because they don't want to be linked to your disappearance. What are you talking about? Let me guess, they pick you up down the street at a 7-Eleven so your car isn't parked outside the house. The phone number you called for the job doesn't exist and they pay you in cash. Well, my family and friends know I'm here. Where? At your house. But they don't know the address. Do you even know my parents' names? They're... Yeah, your family and friends don't know shit. Certainly not enough to tie you to us. What are you gonna do to me? Now that's the first smart question you've asked all day. Don't worry, I'll make it quick. It won't be too painful. Painful? Yeah, I've gotten really good at it. You can run, but you can't hide. 911 operator, what's your emergency? I need your help. Somebody's trying to kill me. Ma'am, what's your location? I don't know the address. Can you check my phone number? On it. We'll send people soon. There you are. Tiffany, please. We could be friends. I don't need friends. I don't think your parents would want you to do this. I don't think you know my parents at all. Jess, don't be scared. Police, open up. That was quick. You shouldn't have done that. Thank you for coming so quick. She's in there. We checked the house. It was empty. Well, did you check outside? She must have ran away. Can you describe her for us? Yeah, her name's Tiffany. She's the daughter of the people that live there. Nobody's lived there in over 50 years. What?